Well, let me show you a little something real quick. If you're ever buying a leg of lamb and you see that gland in there, okay. well that butcher don't know what he's doing. He's done. So you always want to take that out. What's going to happen is if you cook that, you're going to have a gamey taste. A bitterness, right? A bitterness, yeah. exactly. So you want to make sure that's gone. Well, you know, it's funny because there's a lot of people who love lamb, but then there's also a lot of people who don't like that because they feel it's a gaminess to it. Yeah, and because it wasn't cold, it wasn't cooked right. Okay. What I do is I just kind of roll it, and now it's pretty much even where you can grill. Do you put all your seasonings in this and then roll it back up, tie it you up? You can. And roast it? You can. You're just going to kind of put it back together, and now you have football shape, bonus right. leg of lamb that's been And stuffed. just cut it in slices? Exactly. Wow. No one realizes the type of work that goes into breaking down stuff like this. This is and, hard. And that's the hard part now, oh, finding good people butchers. People who can do this. They don't look beyond, they think we just cut this thing and that's out. Well, over the 49, over the, how long, 39 years that I've done this, I've learned the anatomy of it. So every time you get something, you already know what you're doing. Close your eyes and do it. How long did do you think it took for you to get really comfortable with breaking down all of this stuff? Thirty-nine years. There. <laughs>